Bonjour, comment ça va? And welcome back to my channel. My name is Lazius K, and I talk about the practical usage of VR. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and for your continued support. Today, in season one, episode nine, whew, I'm going to be introducing an app called Flex, which is an online collaborative media player where you can play all your media content with friends and collaborators within the same environment. Whoa, very cool. All right, without further ado, let's roll the intro. <laughs> Welcome back. Remember to like and subscribe, share some love so that together we can grow the community. Yeah, because that is what it's all about. All right, today I'm going to showcase Flex, which is an incredible online collaborative app where you can share your media with everyone else. Remember, I spoke about big screen the other time. Check out that video. I'll put a link in the description below. All right, without further ado, let's go into the Oculus. Okay, so we're back in the Oculus. Now let's go and check out Flex. Okay, so after you load the app, what you will see is you'll see your main menu panel arrives here. You're inside a private apartment, which is pretty nice. I can almost feel like I can go outside the door. I can't wait for VR to evolve in a way where we can stand out the couch and walk around the places that will be absolutely amazing. And as you can see on the left hand side here, there's another panel where you can actually add friends. So there are different ways to add friends. You can add friends from your Oculus. So if they're online, they'll actually show up here. So I could actually send him an invitation now. Or you can create an account on the actual Plex website and you can ask other collaborators or friends to do the same. So what you do is you click on add friend and then you just put their username or their email address here and then you send to them and they will automatically receive a notification uh, when you when you send something so let's go into the settings in the settings you can actually change environment so uh, void will be nothing but stars so you're under the stars there which is pretty cool like this okay, I'm going slowly and then you also have a drive-in theater. How a drive-in theater, you have to pay premium for it. And this will be at their website. Okay. So you go back to the luxury apartment. And you can also change your avatar. So this is me there. And this is how people will be able to see your, um, your avatar. Okay. You can't customize your avatar looks and feels, but you can just choose from the ones that they provide, which are pretty, pretty cool, I find. Okay. And then you can also, whilst you're watching together, if you have a headphone with a mic, you can use a push to talk. Um, you can also share what I'm watching with friends when I'm available, uh, whether you want to always share, ask or never share. And then you can sign out or contact the support as well. So there we close. So to browse your menu, it's very simple. You just use the, the, your thumb to go up and down. And then let's watch this, uh, this video. Oops, there we go. It will pop up in front of me. There's a little delay because I'm actually using the record function. So I click on it. And all the blinds are going to shut close down and the screen is going to appear okay so you can see the blinds closed and what you can do is okay let me pause the video you can actually make the screen bigger or make the screen smaller and you can also move the screen around so this is pretty pretty useful okay so you can just imagine here on the couch having a friend I might do a video next time and invite a friend to show you what it's like. We can do interviews here in the future as well with other content creators and app developers as well. But this, I've tried a lot, a lot, a lot of different apps. And other than big screen, this is probably the second best 
because you can invite quite a number of people here. A big screen, I think, at the moment is limited to five or nine people. And here you can actually invite much, many more people. Uh, especially if everybody's internet connection is good, then you can really see things pretty well together. Okay? So you also have uh, the settings here. So you can change the, the format of the video, whether you want 3D or just normal. You also have, if you have a 180 videos or 360 videos. So I'm actually in a sphere in my video here, but on you it might look very flat. Put back to rectangular. You can change also the, the video quality as well. And it tells you whether there's subtitles or no subtitles, okay? So you have some options here for depending on the media that you want to play, okay? And you can just go back to your files like I just did just now, that way, or I can, yeah. And you can also search by name if you have many, many files. So this app is really cool, really useful for watching with other collaborators. And yeah, I can really see myself using it when, I, uh, when my video editors have, for example, a VR headset. I can really see myself meeting them here and going through the changes together in VR. And of course, you can watch movies together. So for example, if your family members live abroad or you have a friend abroad and you want to spend some time together within a immersed environment, then together you can watch movies. And I think that's pretty, pretty cool. So it doesn't work without Wi-Fi. To watch uh, stuff with your friends, you need the Wi-Fi. You need the internet, very important. All right, let's jump out of VR. All right, so today we spoke about Flex, which is a very cool app, which enables you to invite all your friends from all over around the world to view the content with you within the same immersive environment. Whew, that was a mouthful. Remember to like and subscribe, comment below, let me know if this video helped you, or if there are any other subjects you'd like me to talk about so that I can produce the videos for you. Whew. Until next time, take it easy, DJ Q Music. Oh.